take him as a man of few words, but this author of pain might write a brutal ending tonight. That was a nice one, Cole. Akam often dresses like he's going to war, and tonight's match might be a war. Yeah, if I were his opponent, I'd find a white flag pronto. Oh, a flying forearm on the mark. Nailed it. Elbow drop. Piercing. Boom. A leg drop. What a stomp. Good grief. Oh, what incredible power. Wow, what a vertical suplex. Boom, what impact. For many years, members of the WWE Universe and the WWE Locker Room have felt that tag team matches should have two referees. One referee is in the ring overseeing the action, and the other is located out on the floor, making sure teams follow the rules and do not engage in potentially damaging behavior. I think it's a good idea, something perhaps Mr. McMahon might want to consider. Scoop slam! Ooh! Beautiful technique. Byron, earlier you raised a point that people have been talking about for years, and that's a second referee being appointed to tag team matches. I remember WWE Hall of Famer and former WWE President Gorilla Monsoon used to express his strong advocacy for two referees being appointed to tag team matches. Uh, it's something that's been talked about for decades, Michael, and I don't think it's ever going to happen. We've seen it on occasion, but I think it's best to let the superstars be responsible for themselves. And the appointed official for the match needs to do the job they're paid to do. I don't think it's that much to ask. Absolutely spiked. DDT. What a stomp. Good grief. Nailed it. Oh, no. Inverted atomic drop. Neck breaker after the float over. That was pretty. Been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. Jaw shattering. A running body press. Oh, what impact. Oh, oh man. Man. That's gonna hurt. It's Scott Dawson on the defensive now. This tag team match can get out of hand quickly if he doesn't mount an offense soon. The beauty of tag team competition is that he doesn't need to take the entire brunt of the opposition's attack. Though the thought of making a tag doesn't necessarily appear to be on his mind right now. I know it's early, but he has to do everything in his power not to let this get out of hand. Axe Handle finds the mark. Axe Handle finds its target. During the rivalry between the Hardy Boys and Cesaro and Sheamus over the Raw Tag Team Championship, the teams became very familiar with one another. In June of 2017, the teams met in a two out of three falls bout on Monday Night Raw. The most important fall in a two out of three falls contest is the first fall. If a team can win the first fall, that sets the tone for the rest of the match and your opponents are playing catch up. I don't know where he gets the energy, but it seems endless right now. Oh, a knee! Lights out. The two out of three falls match that saw the Hardy Boys go at it with Cesaro and Sheamus was a throwback of sorts. Throughout the 1960s and 70s, championship title defenses and grudge matches were often decided in the two out of three falls format. Cesaro and Sheamus didn't waste any time and scored the decisive first fall after a broke kick rocked Jeff Hardy. Cesaro and Sheamus wanted to continue their domination of Team Extreme, but the Hardys had other ideas as Matt tied things up at one fall apiece after a twist of fate on the Swiss sideboard. After a swanton bomb by Jeff Hardy, the match broke down, and the third fall was ruled a double countout. What a stomp. Good grief. What a clothesline. Out sprayed Buster. Lariat. Oh, what a boot to the face. This is not the place where you want to underestimate your competition. Absolutely not. Inching closer to his, and he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. Beautiful neck breaker after the float over. That was pretty. Oh, flying forearm. That'll turn your lights 
kicks out. Oh boy, he is rolling. He'd be wise to stay right there. Boom! Nasty backbreaker. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? It might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. Nobody controls the pace of a match. Quite like a thunderous Russian leg sweep by Aker. But I don't know how much gas he has left, guys. Fight goes Sid. Oh! To think, I almost rode him off earlier. Did you see the impact on that? Wow! He could pin his opponent right here. One, two, 